How you doing? My name is Mike Ulrich. I'm standing here today at Marine Max Venice. I'm going to give you a video walkthrough on the Sea Ray 250 SDX. This one is the smallest of the SDX lineup. It's going to go 25, 27, 29. This one's going to be your first step into that category. The SDX is going to be their Sun Deck boat, which has been one of their top sellers since it was released. And this one's number one objective is family entertainment aboard and doing it comfortably. Right off the bat in the back of this boat, you're going to notice a swim platform unlike anything else. You have the full width of the boat. Most of the time, it's going to be this notched out section where you lose this spot. Sea Ray's thought of it by simply putting that blocking plate over it allows you to use the whole back of the boat. A unique thing that this boat gives you in the outboard class is this cool little track feature. Now your swim platform is even bigger and you can use it as a swim platform as a lot of people are familiar with on the uh, stern drive models on lakes. You can still have the outboard application in salt water, but still have a massive sun pad on the back of it that you can use to lounge out, enjoy yourself, listen to music. You can even fish off of it. Um, just a lot of room and it's nice when you're pulled up next to the dock, it's easy on and off. You'll notice that it's one level through the whole boat. So as you come into the cockpit, you've got a lot of room. You can still walk through with this slid forward. But when I put it back into the back position, it's nice and easy to have a nice entryway. Like I said, the SDX lineup is going to be known for family entertainment. Look at this massive cockpit. Nice and easy. Everybody can sit here and simply move in these two seats back. You can now have one area that everybody can be a part of the conversation. With this sports tower arch that they have on it, a lot of headroom, okay? You're not crunched in here and everybody can be in the shade. So if everybody wants to not be in the sun, they can be here. But if, of course, it is an open bow, so if you want to be in the front of the boat to be in the sun, you can. Let's take a look at the helm here. You'll notice probably right off the bat, this is not a small dash. This is a 12 inch Simrad. Everything's going to be integrated into that. Your fusion head unit here, nice toggle switches so you can see whatever is on or off. And it's going to have a nice bolster. So no matter who's driving, be nice and comfortable. Flip that bolster up if you want to drive seating or standing. Over on the passenger side, same setup. You guys can sit side by side. A unique thing about this boat that is different from the 27 and 29 is going to be your port side walkthrough. The reason that they did that is because this actually has somewhat of a cabin. Uh, it is a bow rider, but below you're going to have a nice area. It does have an optioned head in there, but you'll see it's got seating uh, and almost pads. So this actually drops down, conforming the whole front of this into um, kind of like a playpen. Uh, it's nice and small. It's great for kids if they want to go down there and hang out and get out of the sun. But it's also excellent for storage, big beach chairs, uh, sandbags, anything like that. It's a nice area that you can just get that easy and out of the way. Let's come into the bow. Nice high sides in the walkway. As you come into the front, you can get a filler cushion in here to make all this one massive sun pad or have the seating as you see. Cup holders below. A nice subtle touch that Sea Ray does. Reason being is if you have your drinks in there and you hit some waves, hit some bumps, your drink spills, it's going on the floor. It's not going on your interior. Small touch that Sea Ray does, but for those that have been boating, get it. Up in the front of this one, you're going to have concealed a beach boarding ladder and a designated spot for your anchor. So down here, if you want to beach it onto a sandbar, but easy on and off from the front, you can do so. Guys, I don't have enough time to go through everything on this boat, but if you'd like to see more, this one is located here at our Marine Max Venice. Uh, location. Again, my name is Mike Ulrich. Thanks for watching.